So Amber's minions have made Cunny to delete their article celebrating one of their alumni because the said minions deemed it not appropriate. And now Amber and her supporters are being bashed for the alleged blackmail. Cunny, the City University of New York, published a feature on its blog celebrating one of its alumni. Mina, who worked on Depp's legal team in his recent successful defamation trial against ex-wife, Amber Heard, the victim graduated from Cunny's Hunter College in 2015 and went on to become an associate at Brown Rudnick LLP, the law firm representing Depp in his legal battles. Yerlin Mina, a 29-year-old graduate of Cunny's Hunter College, was featured in an article and emailed to students as part of the school system's newsletter. In the article, reviewed by UPI, Mina gave her advice to students applying to law schools. The article noted that Mina, a third-year associate attorney at the firm Brown Rudnick, was the youngest lawyer on the team that defended the Pirates of the Caribbean actor in his high-profile defamation lawsuit against ex-wife Amber Heard earlier this year. I worked with the team on the opening and the closing and was the master of the facts of all the evidence, Mina said in the Cunny article. If someone needed pictures or text messages, I would look them up and assist everyone as we went along. The article has since been replaced on the Cunny website with a message noting that the university system received complaints from students with strong negative emotions about the article. Cunny officials also apologized for publishing the article. A message from Cunny Brass read, We understand the strong negative emotions this article elicited and apologize for publishing the item. We have removed it from our Cunnyverse blog. The article was not meant to convey support for Mr. Depp, implicitly or otherwise, or to call into question any allegations that were made by Amber Heard. The statement said, Domestic violence is a serious issue in our society, and we regret any pain this article may have caused. The decision to remove the article was condemned on Twitter by Casey Johnson, a professor at Cunny Brooklyn. One line of the institution's groveling apology could even be read as casting doubt on the jury's verdict in the civil case. Johnson tweeted, Cunny's message to talented young grads who go into the law seems to be, we'll celebrate you only if we institutionally approve of your client. The Cunny controversy comes as several celebrities appear to have withdrawn their likes from Depp's post-trial statement on Instagram, two months after he emerged victorious from his defamation court battle against Heard. I am harassed, humiliated, threatened every single day. She's the one who claimed she was receiving hate every single day, and now she's allowing the same hate to be directed toward an innocent woman. A fan tweeted, What a shame that a cunny can't celebrate the accomplishment and hard work of one of its alums without people crapping on a court decision they don't like. The former student's accomplishment is no less fantastic. Sad that a cunny doesn't have the spine. These people call themselves feminists claiming that's why they actually support Amber. Because they are feminists. But of late they have been going after fellow women and it's just sad and very hypocritical. A fan tweeted, It's also amazing that these supposed feminists keep attacking women. They are specifically trying to destroy the careers of professional women who have worked hard to earn their success. Camille, Dr. Curry, Judy, Judge A, and now this lawyer. It's insane. Well, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching.